And the next thing to draw is the bore. So bring your drawing to front view. I'm going to start with cylinder, so CYL. Click anywhere. But first change the direction of your Z axis vector by going to the coordinates panel, click the Z, click anywhere on the screen and bring it full upward. So CYL, click anywhere on the screen, type D for diameter option and enter 13. And bring it downward for 11.06. The next one would be a cone. So C-O-N-E. Snap the center. Snap the quadrant. Bring your cursor downward. Right click and select top radius and enter 3.5. And the height is 3. Next one would be cylinder. So CYL, snap the center, snap the quadrant, and bring your cursor downward for 12 units. Another cone, C-O-N-E, snap the center, snap the quadrant, bring your cursor downward, right click. And select top radius and enter 2.5 and the height is 1 I think let me check yeah and cylinder CYL snap the center snap the quadrant bring your cursor downward for one unit another cone snap the center right click Select top radius and the radius there is 3 and the height is 0.5. This one here. And cylinder. So CYL. Snap the center. Quadrant. Bring your cursor downward for 5.75. Cone. Same process. Center. Snap the quadrant. Top radius. And enter 3.25. And the height is also 0.25. Let me check. What is the height here? I'm just going to double click. Yeah, this is 5 and this is 0.25. Now, I'm going to measure the total height because I want it to be the same as the height of this object here. So, DI from the center and the center of the bottom. See that? Click that first cross, the very bottom. And I'm just going to make sure center hover over on the side. And click and the distance is 34.56 which is the same as this one now I'm gonna combine the objects here so type in U and I for union command and just window the whole thing and this one I'm gonna combine to you and I window the whole thing I'm gonna move from center to the center of the face here and you subtract command so SU for subtract click the object you want to keep right click and click the object you want to subtract which is the bore this one here enter and there you go